Hey friends and welcome to my channel. I am Yoshida and this is Norris Cove. If you're new to my channel and you'd like to see anything planner related, this is the place you would love to be and we would love to have you. And please hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell and um, make sure that you come back for more content. Okay you guys, so today I'm in my A5 finally. Um, I still, as you see, I have things stuck in here. I was waiting on some inserts from 1407, the plastic ones, and I want to measure for my Erin Condren. So, we're going to get the plan. Let me see. Let me find the... Here we go. I got this one. Lord, thank God I ordered another one because I don't think that's the one I want to use. I'm sorry, I thought I was prepared, so here we go. Yeah, so we're going to do this because I'm debating if I'm going to still use my A5 for right now. Um, move some stuff out of the way. I just don't know. I kind of want to use my A5, I love my A5, and I was thinking, I mean my B6, and I was thinking um, the A5 would be my catch-all and would replace my... Um, happy planner okay you guys so today let me give you a nice little zoom in real quickly so this is a new kit that will be in my shop probably by the time that you see this video this kit will be in my shop um, it'll be releasing on Sunday so first you get this is the sweater weather uh, kit you get uh, let's see this one two three four four full checklist box and four half checklist box and the half has the bows and rose gold foil you get half boxes here and they're really more like quarter boxes and you get some flags here four flags over here and then your appointment box is here at the bottom and then here are your to do's your todays your flags your date dots and your weekend sticker banner or what have you. Here you have your date covers, your washi, little washi, thick washi. Here you have your glitter headers and um, they are foiled, if you can see. And then you have a couple of bill due um, here. You have your scripts here. You have the habit tracker here, a large habit tracker and three small habit trackers here. And again, this is your um, foiled uh, washi. And then here you have nine full boxes. Let me turn it around so you can see. Nine full boxes and you get foiling. And there's a little bit of foiling. I was gonna take this foiling off, but I just decided to um, just leave it a little bit, just for a little bit of uh, amp. And as you see, there is a doll here. On the computer, her little sweater looked kind of orange, but it came out red. I'm totally good with it. And she's gonna stay right there <laughs> and so she's on here too and so as you can see I have some more of her in different hairstyles and like here she has on a burgundy sweater which will go perfect and the brown will go perfect with this kit and then here she's red brown and some blonde hair um, I was debating whether to sell these in my shop I did find these on Etsy they are okay to, for commercial use but it's like uh, I gotta reread it because it's kind of hard to understand like um, I think you can do it like if you add something to it but you can't claim them as yours which I, I'm not trying to do that clearly I've not painted these dolls so I'm going to look into that and if I decide I'm going to put them in there and I may just start them off as a $2 Tuesday so we'll see. And then here I have these little bits from Print Petticoat Bandit. <clears throat> I want to add these little babies here to some things and we'll see. So let's jump right on in. So what I'm going to do is start with my date covers and date dots. And then I'll probably fast forward through that. Oh, let's get the week together.
Okay, you guys, so I'm back. So I've laid my date covers and date dots, and this is what it's looking like. Um, one kit I did, I did the florals, and I was going to do that again, but um, I realized it might be just a little too busy. Now, this washi, it's really for like the Erin Condren. I'm thinking it's too thick. And you know what I'm going to do? I think I'm going to cut this in half because it's so thick. And I need, well, I was thinking I need, need it on my area. I don't know. Let's see. I'm going to lay it anyway. I'm gonna lay it just like that and prayerfully I was thinking of getting oh Lord I was thinking of getting an Aaron Condren because Happy Planner is playing <laughs> Happy Planner is playing with my life I just want that's why I really stick a lot in my uh, traveler's notebook because I need just basic. I need, oh shoot, well, it's down now. I need black and white. That's what I need. I'll save this for like a box or something. And then I'll take these washi and place it here on the back, the thin washi. Yeah, so I just want a basic black and white so that that's why I really love, love, love my um, uh, traveler's notebooks because I can buy plain inserts. Oh, hmm. I can buy plain inserts and just do whatever it is that I want to do with them. Okay, so I kind of like to start over here in my. Uh, what is this section called? Y'all guys help me. Let me zoom out just a little bit. Okay, first of all, let's get some of this stuff out of the way. And you guys know what? This tape is kind of... Remember I used this last week? Um, it's still kind of blending here. I may use that again. Um, I like to start over here in this section. So what I'm going to do is take uh, a to-do... And then, I think we already got a foil header, so I'm going to take it to do. I am very, 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 very <laughs> proud of myself with this sticker kit here because I took my time with this one. And, you know, I tried to pick out colors and just use something kind of different. And since that has that, like, foil header, I'm going to take one of these. Nope, I'm going to take one of these. And I created this thing, like, doing the measurements myself as far as, like, I know, and I know everybody's like, well, why do you have, don't have an Erin Condren, but the kits are geared towards Erin Condren, because uh, when I was kind of looking, I, because I had, first of all, I had a, um, but I have a tracker here, I had a Erin Condren Deluxe. And when I first got into making kits, I was basically making budget kits. And that was pretty much it. So, I knew the Erin Condren box sizes. So, and a lot of the boxes I had to do on trial and error. And so, you know, this looking crooked. <sighs> it never fails. So, anyway, um... Yeah, so I had to uh, do that. So, in my research... That's how I came up with the box sizes for the Erin Condren. So, and they said that the Erin Condren and the Happy Planner were about the same. So, I figured that I would do that because it's really for like Erin Condren Happy Planner. So, that's why um, I have those sizes. And plus, I was using kits from other people. Okay, put that there. Can y'all see? Okay, let me zoom in just a little bit because I don't want to forget to like zoom out. 
So, this whole row is crooked, crooked, and it's not coming up. I don't know where the um, stuff is at. I'm gonna have to break this up with a straight line or something. Here, here's a box. Let's see. So, I was saying that, um, well, you know what, that one didn't cut good. I was sitting here bragging just a little too soon. But I'm going to use it, <laughs> and then I'll figure out what happened with that one. But um, to straighten this line up here, I got to get it straight. So I'm going to put an illusion that it's straight. There we go. And then I'm going to put one of my little people here. There. Let's see. Let's use her here with this YouTube thing. I lost my train of thought, y'all. Part of aging, but... Um, I think I was saying, yeah, so that's how I came across um, my sizing for my boxes, and so now I just know the sizes, so I just do them, and sometimes I'll recreate, I don't sometimes go back and copy another kit that I've done, I'll just go ahead and recreate, like this kit I recreated from scratch because I wanted to do the boxes right, and um, this says to do, I wanted to do the boxes right. So I um, just did them from scratch, and I wanted to um, offset them. So, but this is pretty much, I think, one of my best kits as far as um, cutting wise goes. I'm going to use this one, and I really appreciate those my planner babes who have ordered from me. I really, really do because I mean, from day to day. I'm just like, I don't need to do this. I just really enjoy making them for myself. So for me, if it's a little cut wonky, I don't care. <laughs> you know, that's just me. That's because I did it. So I don't care. But anytime I'm producing something for someone else, I'm a nitpick and nitpick. Um, if y'all could really see the process that I go through of actually um, getting you guys orders together, I'm like, uh... I'm going to put this checklist down because I'm going to get some things done. And I think I need a full box checklist for this. So I'm going to use this orange one. So yeah, the the process I go through, the nerve-wracking the nerve that I take myself through to... I'm going to put this here. This whole little dish is working me. Okay. Um, to get everybody's order. And I just worry, worry, worry until... It makes it to you until I know that you're satisfied and then I just beat myself up a little bit more and then I'm just like okay cut it you should cut it <laughs> so each time I'm just continuing to work on it so and they're getting better so even though you all know that I'm new to this and you still are supporting me I really really appreciate it okay let's see yeah, I was dying to use this kit. I was like, okay, I think it's cut really good. Um, I'm going to do another habit tracker up under here. But I want to do another little piece of foil. Let's do some of this sweater foil. Yeah, so I don't know if my machine needs to be calibrated or what. But just certain things. So I just double check. And if it's not right, I'll tell you this. Go, What's going on? Oh. That one's crooked. After I done sat there and got it straight. I had went through so much paper. Um, and I originally didn't buy paper a lot at first because I didn't want to, um, you know, I didn't think I'd have a lot of orders. But I've gone through, out of 100 sheets, when I decided, okay, I'm going to reopen my shop, I probably threw away 60. <laughs> So I was a little hot about that, but it's a part of learning. Okay, here, I haven't used any of these headers. Let me um, use these, because these didn't come out the way I expected, the glitter part, but the foiling helps. Okay. But I do, I like the way this kit, so I, when I do these kits, I just think of them how I want them to be, and I kind of design it in my head a little bit. Okay, this one, hmm, that one ain't cut right. Now I did two of these, so hopefully 
I didn't pick up the wrong one. And I, I did. Like, see, this one is the same one. This one I redid because of the foiling. And this one has more foiling. But this one is cut better. And I've already put that one down. But I'm going to use these boxes here. So, yeah, it's a struggle. <laughs> I take myself through it. Because I like, how can this one? So I just kind of basically am teaching myself. So we know we need to YouTube. Oh, Etsy. We need to update Etsy. So um, I'm just basically teaching myself and, um, you know, just learning kind of as I go. And again, I just appreciate anyone who's, you know, supporting me as I'm, you know, basically teaching myself, but at the same time, you know, producing because I've gone through some paper. Do you understand me? I've gone through some paper, but it's all good. So anyway, enough about this paper <laughs> in this shop. I'm telling you, it's enough, but, um,
This is my A5. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, I may have fast forward through some, not sure yet. I know I was kind of talky talky, but I hope you guys enjoy. Um, this is my sweater weather kit. It should be in my Etsy shop once you see this video. So was, this is for the week of Monday the 30th through Sunday the 6th. And this is the back. And this is what it's looking like. Gorgeous. All right, you guys. So I will see you all in my next video. Again, if you're new and you enjoyed today's video, please hit that subscribe button. Also, hit that notification bell. Don't forget, check out my Etsy shops. Look around, see if there's anything that you like. And place an order. And if you use the code GRAM, G-R-A-M, all caps, uh, 10, you'll get 10% off your order. Thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you in my next video. Bye.